How's it going everyone? So today we're working on a 2020 Jeep Gladiator and we just updated our TPMS 5 tool and we now have the ability to access secure gateway vehicles. Now there are a few steps we have to do before we are able to perform the relearn on this vehicle. So first, you're going to need an auto auth account. Now if you don't already have an auto auth account set up, there are some videos on YouTube or even Snap-on can show you how to set up your auto auth account. So first, we're gonna to go to autoauth.com or webapp.autoauth.com. Both will take you to the same place. Then we're gonna hit login. So now we'll need to enter our username and password. And then hit login. So now that we're all logged in, you'll see that our shop is already set up and active. So right at the top here, we're going to select Manage Tools. Then it'll show that we already have some TPMS tools all set up. So we'll go to add our new tool. So we'll select Add Tool. And then under Manufacturer, we're going to select Snap-on. And then under Tool Model, we'll select TPMS. Now your list may look different, but regardless, select TPMS. So now we need to enter our tool serial number. Now your tool serial number is on, located on the back of the tool, but it can also be found in settings on the tool itself under about. So we'll go ahead and enter our tool serial number. And then hit add. So it'll tell us that our tool has been added. Now we also have to set up our login information on the TPMS5 itself. So let's head on over to the tool. Now on the tool, we have to set up our auto auth login to make sure that the tool can communicate with the auto auth servers. Now, before you do any of this, make sure that your tool is connected to Wi-Fi. You can see right there that we are. And if you're not, go to settings and go to Wi-Fi setup. But so also in settings is where we set up our auto auth profile. So if we go to settings, then we select profile. If we scroll down to the bottom here, you'll see SGW username and SGW password. So we'll go ahead and enter that in real quick. And for our password, we're just going to move over here real quick. So now that we've entered both of those in, we'll just hit save. And now we are ready to perform our relearn on our 2020 Jeep Gladiator. So now that we've got our secure gateway login all set up, all we have to do is just go to TPMS, and then we'll select our 2020 Jeep Gladiator. Select the number of wheels. And then, first we need to scan all the sensors. So now that we've scanned all the sensors, we have to go over and hit relearn. Then you'll see it, another option for SGW OBD. So we'll hit that, and then it'll give us some instructions and say to start the SGW relearn. Then we gotta connect our OBD cable and make sure the car is on. Now, once the ignition is in the run position, we'll hit relearn. Now, this may take a few seconds because the TPMS-5 is communicating with the auto-auth and the secure gateway. And there you go, 